Hi guys, we have a nice exponential problem under the, the root 7. We have 5 to the 16 plus 5 to the x over 5 to the x plus 5 to the 2 equals 5. Here as you can see you have a variable x, here as well you have the variable x. So what is the first step to solve this? So what we are going to do is, first I'm going to write the radicant, that is the 7th root and under that we have 5 to the 16 plus 5 to the x over you have 5 to the x plus 5 square is equal to 5. Now to remove this root what I'm going to do is take raise this to the power of 7 and it should be raised on both sides so here as well 5 to the power of 7. Now I can cancel out this root and the power 7 so I'll just have 5 to the 16 plus 5 to the x over 5 to the x plus 5 square is equal to 5 to the 7. Now this is like a single fraction. What we can do in the next step is just cross multiply things. Alright, so we have 5 to the 16 plus 5 to the x is equal to here I have 5 to the 7 times I'm using parenthesis for this term 5 to the x plus 5 square. Now the next step we're gonna open the parenthesis 5 to the 16 plus 5 to the x is equal to 5 to the 7 times 5 to the x plus we have 5 to the 7 times 5 square. Now, as you can see, we have an x term, we have an x term. I'll just bring this term this side and bring this term the other side. Here I have the constants. This is as well a constant. So I have 5 to the x. When I bring it this side, minus 5 to the 7 times 5 to the x is equal to when bases are same, there's multiplication, you add the powers. 7 plus 2 is 9. So I have 5 to the 9s, this one. And when I bring this, th the other side, I have 5 to the 16s. All right. Then what I have next is, I have 5 to the x, 5 to the x. Let me take it out common. So 5 to the x times here I'm left with 1 minus 5 to the 7th which is equal to here I have 5 to the 9th minus I can write 5 to the 16th as 5 to the 9th times 5 to the 7th. When I add 9 to 9 plus 7 I get 16 back. So what I have now is 5 to the x times I have 1 minus 5 to the 7th is equal to now I can take 5 to the 9th common outside so I'm left with 1 when I divide them and here when I divide them 1 minus I'm left with 5 to the 7th now as you can see on left hand side and right hand side I have the same term 1 minus 5 to the 7th as they are getting multiplied I can just cancel it off so I'm left with 5 to the x is equal to 5 to the 9th so when bases are same and there's equal to between them, I can just equate the powers. X is equal to 9 and that's our answer. So I hope you have learned something new today. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Take care.